Hey guys, welcome back to Small Snooker 19 and part 23 of our career mode. Today we take on Anthony McGill in the European Masters second round, best of seven frames, last 32. It's going to be an interesting one today. Uh, I'm looking forward to taking him on and uh, we'll see how he is in this game. You know, he's, he's a very good player. He's had a poor season really, but... Uh, you know, it'll be interesting to see how he's represented in game. Thank you for all the support on the series so far. From today, okay, though, it, uh, to today will be the last uh, day of two Snooker 19 videos you, um, daily, but it will continue right. every day at 1 p.m. Uh, UK time. And uh, there he is. He is bold on this game. <laughs> His pitcher wasn't bold, but he's bold. <laughs> so, here we go. It's. Uh, See how we're doing today. Obviously, we ended up in a beautiful 1 4 1 break against uh, Ken Doggerty in uh, the last frame of the last match. And that's 4 0. That's not a bad start of this one. Nice little break off there. Pace is very important here, and he doesn't want to underhit this. It's not too bad from Anthony, but he has left us a little tempter here. Is there any way to get onto the black? The thing is, there's not really a way back to ball here. You know, we could hit that uber thin, try and avoid the, the corner pocket. You know, so some people say I should play more safety, but, you know, there's not really an easy safety here. That's so we're just going to knock the long red in. We'll see One. where we can go from here. We've got the pink. Power it in and out of bulk. Yeah, yeah, on that red ne near the black. Oh, well, we missed the pink. Or have we missed the pink? Or have we missed the pink? Oh, well, we have. <laughs> uh, that was very close to being a one. fluke. He really needs to be mindful of pace here. Doesn't want to overhit this. But we would got away with it. Hadn't got on the red that we'd intended. So, quite lucky there, really. The success of this shot is reliant on perfect pace. That looks pretty much perfect. Happy with that one. Well, he's taking it on. Um, not the best attempt. Let's be honest. So, drop this red in. Should be on the pink. The question is, where does the pink go? That's uh, the big problem here. I think it ties things up, so I'm a little bit more inclined to go for the blue here. And we can get on that red He's to the left of the pink sink spot. This into the left corner pocket. We'll make a good chance for ourselves. Leave that pink One there if we shot. need it. Six. A little bit later on. Might actually try and develop the pink spot area now. It's a good chance to do that. Lots of screws. Should be on the pink no matter what. And there you go. You see? Now the pink spot Seven. fully developed. Easy as you like pot. We'll put the cue ball pretty much wherever we want to put it. So, what was, you know, if we'd potted the pink before, the pink 13. gets tied up, it ties up a few reds, but now, we have a really good chance. Fourteen. So, go for the pink, uh, sorry, the brown. Uh, maybe not actually, we might go for the, the yellow. This should be straightforward enough. Should be okay if it pulls off. No, it hasn't, so that might be 16. end of break. I've got a thin snake into the middle. 
don't fancy that any day of the week. A little thin snick in this left corner, which I fancy a little bit more. Pace will be very important with this shot. Give that one a go. And say, you know, oh, well, just missed it. And now Anthony McGill will see how he's playing in close Nothing range because well. that long shot, red not what he was hoping was terrible. For. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 16. Oh, I don't know how the whites just stopped there. <laughs> No. He seemed to wow. play that with the wrong side there. Look he's like lining he's up the long the to the corner here. Oh, oh cracker! Excellent Lovely theory. shot there from Six. Aunt McGill. He's playing with 13. a little bit of uh, urgency and confidence. I like it. Fourteen. Mm -hmm. 20. He's playing the pot here. Oh, that's a cracking shot. 21. He's not quite on the pink, I don't think. Coming for the right centre oh, here. he is. That's a good pot. Well, an excellent so pot. A really good chance here for McGill. He really McGill. looks in fine form at the moment. Former Crucible quarter finalist. 28. Mm -hmm. This is really tricky. He's missed the oh, pot. Not quite. Was and the first Gale. really, really tough shot that he took on in the break. Got him. So, if we can play this with a little bit of right hand side and just sort of bend it slightly, get onto this, this red. It's a tough shot, but maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe it's the pig's too close. Yeah. Potential three ball plant. But, uh, don't fancy that. So. Just wants to get the cue ball safe here. It's just going to be the the safety. Such a shame that we can't get to enough of that. Try it with extreme right. I don't know, maybe this will go in. Let's try it. No. You had to get it right in the centre of the blue zone there. But, uh, you know, we played it as an, with an element of safety. We didn't crash straight into the pink, so... He's taking on the long red we'll to the corner. That. McGill, once again, takes on the long pot, and once again, he's about six foot off. But, uh, again, he's got away with it. So Pace is key, and he certainly doesn't want to overhit this. That red career into something, and it hasn't done. So, here's McGill. Volume four with the long pot. Can he knock this one in? He's tempted by this red. No, oh. not this time. Oh well, this time. Oh well, I was going to say this time he doesn't get away with it, but uh, this is a tough little snick into the middle. This won't be easy. It's there though. What Great top shot. Top that was. Yeah, come round the angles. We're not quite on the pink. One. Certainly a tough shot. So blue crash that into the corner. Deep screw. You'll play this with plenty. Round of off two cushions. See that where we end top. up. We've underhit it massively, but it's actually worked out quite well. We've got the red. Six. Into the left middle, we've got this red along the cushion. 
which is quite tough because uh, we're going to have to play it with a little bit of pace. Shot along the cushion. Well, it's there. Played it nicely. Played it too nicely, if anything. Seven. He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. No issues there. That's a nice shot. We'll have to play that with an extreme amount of right-hand side to check it up. It's a pity that 13. we didn't get to see the white as it uh, checked back. There. But, uh, a little bit Lots of, of follow-through. Might end up putting two Who's reds here. Done? Not quite. Remember that was a, a potential plant, those two reds. 14. Yeah, to sort of squeeze them, though, by uh, hitting them on the other side. So I'm guessing the cannon didn't quite He's lining do that. Up into the left centre pocket. But we've overcut the blue. And overcut it by quite a long way as well. So once again, we're off to a slow start in this match. Johnny but uh, 14. we'll see if Anthony can do anything about it this time. He's tried to play the cannon on that black. Hasn't quite pulled what? it off. So he's going to have two we'll more chances at it. Into the middle pocket. Needs to knock this pink in. Oh, that's a top shot. Well, that red, he's not really impressive able queuing. to get the angle. So I think we are Seven. going to have one more chance in this frame at the very least. He's trying to come back. And I'll tell you what, that it might be half he's a chance here. Played at the right pace. And he's just played 14. the... A slow shot, probably just gonna hit this. Th no, no, he's costly error. Oh, <laughs> well, it could be a free ball foul. Anthony McGill, 14. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 7. Free ball. He's chosen to go with the free ball. Mm. I'm gonna say the blue, blue for the free ball. So... He'll be mindful of pace here. He really doesn't want to overhit this. So that blue counts as an well, extra red. Lost control of the cue ball there. One. Not quite on the brown as I would have wanted, but uh, he's an expert long potter, and he's taking this on. Who dares wins? Or maybe not in this uh, scenario. <laughs> Ronnie, one good the... red from Anthony yeah. McGill. Well, it goes. We should have this Not first frame. That's a cracking shot along the cushion. He's not quite on the colour as he would have pocket. intended. But that's he a good pot on the black. But it won't matter. But again, he's not Eight. on the yellow as he wanted. So long pot, volume yeah. five for Anthony McGill. And this well, time it's in. What a shot camera. that was. Great. So he's 18 shot. points ahead. We'll green in the brown. That. 10. And he's 1 0 up, but once again. There. He'll be annoyed with that. Oh, I don't 13. know if he fancies this into the middle. No. He's playing the, playing the safety. Where's the cue ball going? It's okay. So. Excellent safety shot. Anthony McGill, 13. We're just going to play the rest up here. I don't like playing this shot, but uh, I don't really see any other option here. You know, yes, we could dump it on the side cushion, but it's just littered with risk. Play the no risk shot. Let this. him play the, the tricky trouble. shot. You know, he hasn't played too attacking a shot either. Great so shot. that's a really good safety. You know, now we've got a potential double. Just wants to get the cue ball safe here. Get the cue ball tight on the ball cushion. And yes, we've left a potential long pot for Anthony, but it's a calculated risk. You know, he's missed four of his so six long pots here. so far. so And he misses that one. And where's the cue ball? In the pocket. So, Foul. Ronnie once also again. Four. Well, he's playing on here. So if we stick the cue ball there, so it's a very acute angle, this one. But uh, we drop it in. Well, he's you know, aiming to get the cue ball. Guaranteed position on the blue. And that's there. Good shot. 
Four. So, one good pot here. Slight stun run through to get under the chance. pink. What a great shot that is. And that's okay. Nine. So roll this pink in, get on the black. And we're one nil up and Anthony, much like Ken Doggerty, will be very disappointed. Forward. But it's there. So a trickier black than I would have intended. <laughs> so this is uh, not a nice shot to win the frame. Just this pot required to win the frame. Down it goes. But it's there, and that's a good black that's under good. pressure no to pop there. The to win the frame now. Twenty-two, now. and the first frame. Ronnie Lead up. by one frame to and nil. Now the frame is his. He's taken a one frame lead here and seems in pretty fine form. Thank you. The second frame. Anthony McGill to break. Bad from McGill. He's covered the escape down the right hand side, down the left hand side still here. available. I'm going to hit that a little bit. If there's a gap between the pink and uh, the cluster of three That's reds, he might safety. be able to knock this in, but if he under hits this, so. it could end badly. It's just a thin safety, and he's hit this beautifully. What a shot. He has left this one. And there's a, a gap through the, the red and this is black easy. to get back to bulk. No. Not this time. Close, but a miss nonetheless. Good cue ball. That bothered about the pot. We've left Anthony two potential tempters. No doubt. But his record so far has been abysmal. And there's another one down the drain. So here we go. What a chance this is. First real chance in and around the black spot. I know the first frame was a little bit scrappy uh, and got the first chance really. So hopefully now we get to play that split is not bad a little at bit all. more fluently. A great opportunity. Hey. Not sure what we can do. Oh, yeah, maybe hit this blue black half ball. Play the black into the same pocket. Yeah, that's perfect. Black is a Nine. more trickier than it looks. This is a nasty Tricky little one. Pot along the cushion here. Oh, it wobbles spot. in though. Quality queuing there. You can see there that that kiss has worked out beautifully because I think yeah, that red passes thing. the pink into the middle. Yeah, so half a chance here. There this should go. be pretty straightforward. This will be three reds, three blacks, once this black goes in. Now, who knows, maybe a one four seven attempt could be on the cards Something. here, but we are just going to focus on winning the frame first of all, but if we can stay on the black, I, I will. Well played. 24. Good time to get rid of this red on the cushion. Looking to play this softly. Yep. 25. This looks relatively Seven. easy. On and off the cushion. Just need that to pull up very slightly. Oh, well, I think, I think we're okay. Very, very fortunate. Very, very fortunate indeed. Half ball on the black. Probably screw up for one of those reds on the right hand side. If we under hit, like we have Four. done, we have got that red nearest the black. Same pocket that we just potted the black into, so 
Yeah, we're racking up the points nicely. 41. Once again, we just overhit that very slightly. The cushion, this looks so. pretty simple. Just had to rely on a little bit of luck there with the cannon, and we've pushed a red safe. 48. Which isn't what we intended to do, obviously. We have to pull out one good pot here, but uh, after that should be fairly plain sailing in this frame. And that's there. 49. So, again, one good positional shot here. And it's definitely on. 147, that is. 56. Again, just in a little bit of no man's land. He's taking on the long red to the corner pocket. Yeah, that's Brilliant a good recovery shot, shot though. Half ball on the black. 57. Should be absolutely fine now because we're on this side of the table. All the reds pot into the, the right corner. They're all covering each other to the left corner, but they're, they're all very nice into the right corner, so. Just black. And two more reds. 64. And blacks. We've won the frame at least. As you know, we have our mind very much on different things he finds right now. Into the right middle pocket. Excellent shot. So this black and one more red. Doing extremely well here. 65 for the frame. So we've got the problem of the two reds on the left-hand side, but they, they should be okay. The two reds on the right-hand side aren't too easy either, but you know, getting the right position for them, and it's fairly easy. But there's the frame out of the way, so we are going to be 2-0 up. That should be it. No real way from the start, McGill. 73. So. A bigger bounce than that. I was hoping to get on one of them reds into the right middle, but uh, 80. into the left middle, sorry, but uh, it hasn't quite worked out. So I'm gonna have to play the slightly more difficult one now into the left middle. They're the last of the half a chance here, quotes easy reds. Although well, this is tough in its own right, but it is there. Great pot, so move on to the 11th one. red. So again, just a little bit of work to do with a cue ball. He'll play this with I'm plenty gonna of play power. this with a lot of power. That's ended up a little awkward, but we need a cannon it. of some sort, and that's not too bad. 58. I think we've got this. Worst ways we've got this red into the corner. Too bad at all if you just middle. drop it in, which we do, and it's there. Pot. Super it wobbled in, but it is Thank there. You. So now just a tough black. Drop this in. Get on one of them reds on the left hand side of the table. That's there. Probably play the red closer to the cushion here. 96. So just this red and the black for the sentry. We very much have other things on Not our mind one, here. But a half chance. Oh, oof. he's played that any yeah, harder, and that wouldn't have went in. Ninety-seven. So it's a tough choice, really, what to do here. The harder you hit these, the most likely they are to. Go well. I think you play this with a lot of power. We'll try. Amazing century. Need a bounce. Need a bounce. I tell you what, that's worked out well. Well, I think that couldn't have went any better, really. So 
And it's there. And look at this. Half ball on the black. 105. Basically put this white where we want. Of course, I'm going to play it into the right corner. We'll go up past the the blue here, uh, I think. And uh, oh, we've underhit it, but it should be okay. It should be okay. That was just a little bit of pressure there. Now then, what we did wrong on our one four seven attempt on the online mode was. Uh, not getting on the yellow. <laughs> We're going to try and give ourselves the best chance possible to get a good position this time. And this position is virtually perfect. So, just need to concentrate on potting this black. We've under hit it. We have got a shot on the yellow. 120. So, I'll knock this yellow in. Stun the round off two cushions. The for the green into the green pocket, and that the position for the green. is pretty much perfect. It's on, guys. It is on. 122. Well. Screw across the face of the brown. There it is. 125. So, the fact that the pink is where it is, I don't think the blue passes it in. Well, it probably does. But only if you're right behind it. So, what I'm actually going to do. Oh, oh dear. Oh, I thought I'd uh, messed that up there. Um, I'm going to actually play for the blue into the, the corner. So. Cue ball not really on, the on and off the cushion. Irrelevant in this frame. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. It's as good as we could have hoped for. Now we know what half a ball on the pink. He is, so I'd assume he'd take this on. It's there. Great so This pink. Superb roll it in. One hundred and thirty-four. Virtually guarantee yourself a one-four-seven here. Just got to get ourselves on the black. We drop the pink in. Need that white to pull up, and we have done. But look at this. Imagine being faced with this black for the 147 in real life. This would be horrible. But we are just going to give the pocket every chance. Game. Can he finish off the maximum with this black? That completes a brilliant clearance. Very impressive. He hasn't made yes! Great before. It only wins one frame, but it's a great milestone to achieve it. Well, what a, what a break. And we called it after the second black. We said we were going to go for it, and we've done it. Oh, <laughs> we've got the 147, and what a break it was. Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. We had a, a few recovery shots in it, but we've done it. We've got the 147, and what a, what a feeling that is to do that on this game. Um, and... Uh, yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed that one. But uh, I'm off to get a drink now. But uh, we'll be back in just a second for frame three and four. Hopefully. Well, the 147 box ticked. And I've just stopped dancing around the room. I've got my drink and we're ready to go for frame three here. Hopefully we only need uh, a couple of more uh, frames to win this match. Let's just swap my headphones over. Because I put the wrong ones on. So... Uh, here we go then, third frame we're breaking off here, and we actually found quite a, a nice break off in the in the uh, last last time we broke off. So let's see if we can pull one off here. Oof, a little bit lucky there, a little bit too square, but uh, we'll settle for that. Certainly could have been worse. This is a half chance. Anthony once again going for the no, long pot. Not quite. Pretty close though, but that won't this provide this time. Solid. So here we go then. Once again, we're in around the black spot. <laughs> now let's not tempt fate. I don't think One. anybody's ever got two one four sevens in a row. Certainly not in uh, a competitive match. 
you know. Um, no, there's definitely been two one four sevens in the same day. Eight. Um, possibly even in the same match by different players, but uh, certainly not two frames in a row. So let's see what we can pull off here. Uh, <laughs> it would be pretty crazy, wouldn't it? But uh, right, we've got to go into the pack with some venom here. Let's cut open things up That's nicely. A really good split. And this is a real opportunity. Yep, that's worked out quite nicely. 16. Yeah, got the best split in the world, but uh, certainly some loose reds, which is certainly better than nothing. And we're just floating around the table now, 17. knocking them in. Uh, it would actually be quite nice to time this one. I know there's a couple of achievements for clearing the table completely. In ten minutes, five minutes, that sort of 24. thing. Um, yeah, we're gonna knock this red in and, and not play for the black this time. So, sorry to the folks out there that wanted us to go for two consecutive one four sevens, but uh, I just want to win the you frame nice at this point. On the blue ball here. Twenty-five. This looks this relatively enough so that we avoid the cannon on that red. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. And we're on one of them reds into the um, right corner pocket. We can play the cannon off the, the, the other two reds. And this should open everything into play. Nicely onto the black. 31. A little bit straighter on the black than I would have liked. I do feel like that's uh, the bane of our life re recently. It's been too straight on the black. But uh, that's not too bad. 38. Got this right up into the top left corner. We can play it into the left middle. Whichever we prefer. I probably prefer the corner, but uh, the middle isn't too bad, is it? So... Time for the middle pocket. No, oh, we missed it, for goodness sake. Eliminate errors like that in this match. Yeah, well. So, Anthony McGill, half a chance for you here, but 38 points ahead already. Uh, it's frustrating that we didn't make that chance pay. There's the three frame. loose reds here. Eight. Well, that's a really terrible shot, but he did get two straight on it. He's trying the long pot. Oh, he's got it. Well played, Anthony no. McGill. He's lining this one up. To Far too often pocket. he's uh, played a long oh. pot and missed it. That's an absolutely horrific shot. Of not under hitting this shot. What a terrible shot that was. He deserves Anthony to leave McGill. one on here, and well, he, he hasn't. It's very, very fortunate once again now. This is a half-decent uh, cross-double chance. Oof. Not quite. Well, we were always going to get the cue ball safe, so... He'll be pleased with that. Me with that one. It looks safe. He needs to be wary of under-hitting this. That's a nice shot. I think no, I can't, but uh, I might play it. up to be a really interesting test of their safety skills. Bit of an attack and safety here. Really put an an Anthony under some pressure. We needed for that to work, we needed to get the white on the ball cushion and we haven't managed that, so it's one good pot from Anthony yeah. here. Although we haven't left anything on, so very fortunate from us there. With all these reds on the right hand side now. Then there is this one. It's a toughie. Tricky Keep block in. coming up. Oh, nice, nice, sweetly played. One. So. We knock this black in, goes in, it's a frame winner. Close to the cushion. If it goes in, it's a frame winner, it misses. So. That was a really tough shot, and it hasn't worked out all that well. Ronnie O'Sullivan, one. One. 
Well, it goes half a chance. Brilliant, Paul. Outstanding. They don't come much better than that. Eight. Great opportunity to get back into the match. Nine. Not an easy one, but a half chance. That's a top shot. Outstanding potting. Good shot. Thirteen. So Fourteen points behind. And he's missed oh, it. That's my oh, he nearly flipped it. Well, that was absolutely miles off, and I don't really know why he played it like this that. Is no gimme. Another good long pot from us. One. Red we could really leave was the one we were playing. Didn't quite get on the back as we intended, so it'll have to be the, the long yellow. Taking this yellow on. What a fabulous pot that wobbles is. in. It'll be very Any harder and that wouldn't have dropped. Here. But because we hit it thick, we didn't quite get the Three. cue ball where we wanted. And then we're gonna have have a little look uh at the the black here definitely doesn't go so I have to play this with screw and right hand side to try and get it back up the table it's not too bad I'll have to be be the brown this time probably i think the yellow's a little bit too straight and we're a little bit too close to the cushion to pull that off so Surely the black doesn't go from this angle. To, well, it might do, you know. Ooh. Tough. We, if we played it with left hand side, if it was an exhibition, He's aiming for the left corner here, probably take that on. But uh, well, just knock that, that in. Brimming with confidence and on a bit of a roll at the moment. Mm, perfect on this red. So Eight. What are we on now? Twenty-two points in front. So two reds, two colours. And we take a 3 0 lead. Just need to come and have a, a look at this red, whether it passes into the left corner or. Goodness sake, I hate it when it does that. Right. So we've got the red into the. Well, either pocket works, so I've just got to judge the pace of this correctly. That's pretty much perfect. Happy with that. Just ran on a little bit further than I would have wanted, but uh, this is possible. You'll have to use the rest here, which will make it a little more awkward. Nope. Well, we flipped it. Well, apologies, well, Anthony McGill, for that. <laughs> well played. Well, so we're 28 points in front. Still need the blue and one more red. See, we've took quite low value colours with these two reds, so we do need that other one. He won't be happy with that. So, Anthony McGill still has a little chance 19. in this frame. But we're going to hit this thin, play it twice across. He's playing the safety and aiming to get the cue ball tight against the Just cushion. Just go and miss the blue. No, we knock, oof, nearly knocked the blue in. <laughs> Well, that's, that's not too bad. We got the red where we wanted to, at least. He'll be aware how important pace is for this shot. That's pretty good from Ant McGill as well. He has left a, a slight chance of a shot to nothing here. Thin snick into that left this corner. This be a pretty simple safety here. And it's there. Wonderful and we ball. did only need the red, so... And that shuts the door on his opponent in this frame. One. So it was definitely worth the risk. Where we'd got the cue ball had we missed it. So very, very good. Nice little flick on the brown there. Four. So once again, in a comfortable frame. Should be a little bit scrappy, here. but uh, we take our chance. Break, earlier break of 38. Proving to be the, the key point in this frame. 
and missing a couple of chances though. Missing a few long ones by a long way. Be disappointed with that. He's finished a little bit awkward here, but it doesn't really matter. 13. What a beautiful pot that is. Eighteen. Well, the action that we get on that. Perfect on the black. Twenty-four. Nice little thirty-one break to finish off here. Playing this with plenty of power. There's a cue ball going to end up pretty good. So there you go. Very, very happy with that. 31. And the frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan. Well played to take that frame. Thank you, the fourth frame. Anthony McGill. Now lead by three frames to nil. And one frame away from the last 16 once again. Where putting money on the fact we'll probably be playing Jack Lazowski again. Just can't seem to shake that guy this season. Mm, that's a little bit soft. We need the blue to come to our rescue here. I'm not sure it has. Maybe the well other red shot, might have. Could have played it better. No, He's looking to pop this quite. into the left corner pocket. So Anthony McGill. Improves his long pot stat. And that's all he does. One. So, he'd be very disappointed with his performance, McGill. really. One. Played quite well in the, the first frame. Easy. I don't think he might take that, but uh, we've knocked in that long red. There. And I think yeah. we're on the black. Yep, just about. So, half a chance here early on. I've taken this frame. Nicely played. Eight. <laughs> a little bit of a wobbler there. There's a pink looking into this Nine. left corner. Not good. So blue it'll have to be. He's aiming for the left corner here. That's a great split. He'll be unlucky if he's not anything here. That's a nice shot. 13. Just drop this in on and off the cushion. Ping it into the left centre. It will go on to the yellow spot, so it does just mess the table up a little bit, but it's going at least the right opens these here. reds up. That's a top shot. Well played. He seems full of confidence at the moment. Ooh, this is 21. Nice red to spot. Certainly didn't spot that when we. That's a good split. He's got a real chance here. Started out. Tried to move the, the red off the, the pink spot, but didn't quite work out there. I'm just going to have a look at that red past the, the pink, whether it goes into the, that pocket. I think it does, so... He's playing for the right corner here. Just drop this in. Oh, we've hit that too soft, I think. Great oh. shot. That's well, a wonderful, wonderful pot. Got away with that a little bit. This should be pretty Decelerated on that shot. So a nice little uh, pot on the red, but we once again have overhit it. So, he's attempting to sink pink. this into the left corner pocket. And two nice cushions. Shot. Wonderful pot. Outstanding effort. That's a good shot. 34. Mm, didn't quite like the uh, look of any of them. They're all covering each other. So, once again, deep screw up towards the pink. Might be too much. Just a little bit, Joe. That was poor. Thirty-five. We'll have to be 
the brown lots of top left hand side force it round the table here but as chance, we've seen but chance nonetheless and bounce right out shot. the middles quite easily but position looks pretty good to me it says position looks good what on earth see look at that 39 can we get the window for this red no we're certainly not gonna we could play it with a little touch of left hand side i guess get through to this red Tough shot though. Really tough shot. No. Had to get it in the in the blue zone perfectly and we didn't manage it, so Ronnie O'Sullivan. Aunt McGill. A chance here to get back into the match. One. Good chance to get a foot in the door here. Eight. This is a potential route back into this frame. Nine. This is a real opportunity to get back into this frame. Fourteen. One good Looking pot. Pop this into the left corner pocket. Mm, it's a good shot. Nice. This just not took advantage of good getting on the colour, so one good put on the we blue again. Power, and that's a great example of what he can do. Twenty. Again, he needs to, to back into the frame here. Avoid the kiss, but hasn't done 21. that. Be the long Should pink, I guess. And you know, he was going to miss one of them. He pulled out a few cracking pots to. 21. Extend the break, but uh, his course no may have been ran in this match. Just need a half ball. Nicely onto the colour. Well, not half ball, but uh, an angle on the ping at least. And that's worked out nicely. I'd like to just hit that middle red, slap bang in the face. Well, that's okay. <laughs> I wanted to hit the middle red first, but uh, that's worked out perfectly. So I've just got to drop this in now. As you Eight. can see from that angle, for fine on the black. So, 25 points in front already. This black, red and black, and we're through the next round. 15. So apart from the one four seven, it's not really been vintage uh, from us, but uh, you know we we've played very well, um, you know, in patches. Like you know, we we haven't took all of our chances, but certainly, um, certainly haven't played too badly. Uh, just double checking here. Yeah, we are forty yeah, points in front, so that's a little more difficult. That's right. I'll keep Anthony McGill in his seat, and it does. Impressive shot with the rest. So might Twenty-four. Even just drop him behind the brownie and shake his hand again in the next Looking round. This in behind the brown ball. And there we go. I don't think Anthony McGill will come out of his seat, and he doesn't. So we get that a very good um, frame and match. Ronnie O'Sullivan. And that puts a very good victory over Anthony McGill, overshadowed by the 147, of course, but uh, a good 4 0 victory nonetheless. And 147, very, very happy with that. And we still haven't dropped a frame in this tournament just yet. So, who are we going to be playing in the next round? Is it going to be Lazowski again, or is it going to be somebody else? Let's see. Ooh, Barry Hawkins. Well, this is going to be an interesting one. In the last 16, Barry Hawkins, the world number nine. Who's gone up to number eight then? I thought Robert uh, Hawkins. So Wilson's no number eight. Maybe he is uh, in real life as well, actually. Um, but Hawkins, uh, the number nine. 
uh, in the world. That is going to be a very interesting match in the next episode over the best of seven frames. That's going to be a challenge. So, yeah, that is where we're going to leave it in this episode. If you have enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for daily Snooker 19 content. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.